Jesus wants to give us to drink of the water of life freely. Hallelujah. 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 Is that right? He's not talking about a literal, physical glass of water. Hallelujah. He's talking about drinking of something spiritually. But he's using figurative terms to describe something. Amen? Because Jesus is the water. Is that right? To give, and he is the one that gives us to drink. Is that right? Hallelujah. And it only comes by the Holy Spirit. Any deadly thing, meaning which uh, something which brings death to the body naturally without knowing. All right? And it shall not hurt them. Now look at this. And look at this. They shall lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. So according to what the Bible says in the New Testament here in the Gospels, there are certain things that accompany believers. Not those who just say the name of Jesus. Not those who say I'm saved. But there are certain things that follow them. This is how you can know when somebody is a real true Bible believer. Not a traditional believer, but a Bible believer. Is that right? When religion, let me, let me stop that notion. Let's go to verse 19. So then after the Lord has spoken unto them, he was received up into heaven and he sat on the right hand of God. And they, meaning the disciples or the eleven, whom Jesus had already given authority to, is that right? Yes, sir. Yes. To all these things, to do all these things. Is that right? Mm -hmm. When they was with him before, went forth, they, talking about the disciples, went forth and preached everywhere. So the disciples did work? They preached everywhere. Is that right? Because he just got finished giving them the instructions, the walking papers. You go and preach the gospel. Is that right? Yes. Is that right? Is that right? All right. And so when they heard his instruction, after being upbraided for their unbelieving harness of heart, they decided that it was in their best interest to go ahead and obey Jesus. Hallelujah. All right. And they went forth and preached everywhere. Here's the key. The Lord working with them. Did y'all hear that? The Lord working with them. Is that right? And confirming the word. So the Lord works with the disciples. Yeah. And he confirms the very word. Is that right? Amen. Because then the Lord is working with them. That means this yeah. is something done together in oneness. Is that right? Yeah. In unity. Is that right? Yeah. So you can tell those that believe because the Lord works with them. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. Confirming the word. Look at this. With signs following. Now that we go follow them, we don't need to follow them. They follow us. Because the Lord is working with us. Hallelujah. Amen. So when religion cannot do the works of Christ, they have to make themselves feel better by teaching contrary to what the Bible says. They must make themselves feel comfortable by telling the beliefs of things that they like. You know, such as notions like this. Healing is not for our time. Oh boy. Uh, or it's been done away with. With the apostles. Now you have to have a special gift from God. In order to do these things. Y'all never heard these things before? Huh? Of course I say we're all of the so called. Called. Preachers and teachers of today. Um, no doubt. That God has not called them. You understand how much strength and vigor it takes to come up with these unbelieving notions? Because if Christ really truly have called them, he would equip them. Is that right? Y'all follow my train of thought here for a moment, amen? Because, you know, when we read verse 20, it says the Lord is doing what? Working with them. That, mean, that means the Messiah is with somebody. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Everybody claimed to, claim to have Jesus. Everybody claimed to have, I've got Messiah. I've got Yahshua. But yet and still we hear what they're saying, but we don't see the Lord working with him, confirming, confirming the word with signs following. Yet we got a lot of mama called and daddy sent preachers and teachers. We have an abundant supply of jack leg jackals of preachers now. We got an abundant supply of them. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen.
And they preached everywhere, and the Lord was working with them.